back into what he wants to be. I think he just has to start off with Zero Suit, and he's got to play the same game that he did on game either, I think it was game five, game five of the uh, Winner's Finals, basically. Like, he played a safe game, but just at that time around, he, I think he just let too much time go by, and like Luffy was able to extend too much of a lead. So it forced Quick to try to approach it, and it work out for him. Yeah. At the same time, he's got to figure out how to get around the anti-airs that Luffy presents. Because yeah. Zero Suit is a character that likes to pressure by using landing aerials and stuff like that. He's been using bikes, he's been using up tilt, snare, air to air, a lot of stuff to be able to intercept Zero Suit. So Quick's got to figure out a way around that, play a little bit more grounded, go underneath, something like that. Mm. Yeah, it's really hard to try to contest that bike in the air. It, it, we've seen that Zare is able to stop it right in midair, but he's always getting caught at this position where Zare wouldn't even really have enough time to come out. So this is the reset already. Um, so we're gonna see it working. That's not started. <laughs> we're gonna go to City probably. We'll have to see. And once again, our counter picks are Yoshi's and Kalos, right? Yeah. Okay. Yoshi's Island specifically for out of you, for you out of region uh, players that have Yoshi Story legal. We don't quite have that. Yeah. Nor do we have Unova. Yeah. Okay. Here we go. All right, starting off with Zero Suit Samus, let's see if he can make an, uh, an adjustment. I'm sure he'll be able to, though. That's the part of being a top player. Three, two, one, go! Yeah, this is more of the game I was expecting from Quick, using that, you know, slow chip damage, using that Zero to space out and make Wario really hesitant to really do anything on the shield. However, the, the big problem comes in when Gluttony is able to finally get in and get those big combos that he was looking for. Yep. I think it's a matter of just getting away as soon as the combos start. I mean, you just have to accept the damage as the damage and just cut your losses. Okay. I'm seeing a lot more down B from Quick here. Nicely done. Yeah, he's tired of getting the anti-air. He was able to stall himself in the air with the down air. Alrighty. Okay, got the up air. Not able to get anything else, though. He's got the pressure, though. He's got the positioning. Let's see how good he tries to make it back. He doesn't. Oh, but that was really nice, actually. That wave land afterwards, um, after the, oh. the landing up air, just to be able to get to the ground faster and still continue pressure. Yeah, and I'm starting to notice the prevalence of the anti-airs from Gluttony. It may just be a matter of quick needing to stay on the ground just a little bit more. Woo! Good arc! Yeah, throwing that on. Oh, wow, um, that bike should not be on the stage, but you know, whatever. I think it's literally hanging on like the edge of a wheel. That's really funny, actually. Okay, grabs it. <laughs> now we can stop staring at it and all. And now he's just using that bike pressure again. I mean, he's doing it a lot more in this set than he was in Winter's Finals. Uh, he was using it more in the set before. Yeah, he really is, though, because uh, it's been working. Look at him, he's just tossing it around. I'm trying to catch like a smirk, yeah, there's a slight smirk on Gluten's face, he's having fun with this. Mm. That parry, looking clean. Oh, the parry again. Yeah, Quick, I think Quick is getting a little too close for comfort here, especially with that waft being in the equation. Oh, catching this bike right before it can get uh, thrown off. Yeah, this is what I expect Quick to do, just to be able to force Lutney to try and do something, and then when he thinks he's got him caught on the approach option, just go in with some burst damage like that. But that relies on Quick being very good on his defense, and of course on the offense, catching the right defensive option for Lutney. Because if he mixes it up and gets blown up, then all of a sudden he can get killed at 40. Yeah, it's true. Very true. Lutney is, uh, I would say the Wario is not exactly the biggest combo food, but... Uh, it's not good when Zero Suit Samus is up in your face, especially Zero Suit Samus is this caliber. Yeah, and of course when you get a parry like that, you need being very good at being able to take out how quick he's trying to keep up his wall here with Zero Suit. He's, he just can't throw this bike off of this freaking stage. Like, look at that! Ah! Oh, yep, 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 and he's going to eat that bike again. Maybe even be able to get another walk before the end of this. Oh, the Zero didn't quite connect. Great parry, oh. though. Gluttony's been very good at keeping up with the tempo that Quick's trying to present. Getting those landing up airs, avoiding the dare very slightly, still keeping up the pressure, trying to get that up tilt for the anti-air, but he gets so much damage off of that. Yeah, Quick's got to be really careful here and not play so uh, 
He's frustrated. Okay, there we go. Looking pretty even right about now. Oh, Looney's just giving chase. Yeah, it looks like he wants to close this out quickly, and I think that's how quick can, uh, can really take advantage. Looney's really telegraphing what he wants to do right now. Ah, down air, though. Ah, no! Yeah, 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 yeah. Good interception on that platform. Uh, right here. Looney's been doing a good job of being able to keep up his lead. You saw Quick is trying to do the same game plan that he was before, where he's just trying to stare at perfect range, and then um, Looney can't do anything out of it. The jump fair out of shield is just not going to reach and stuff like that. But he's just been able to find those small instances where Quick just does not quite face it correctly. He just tries to go in, get aggressive, he gets impatient, and then Lutni is able to come in with the first damage, and that's exactly what Wario can do. He can get a big combo, he can get a lot of percent off of it, and he can kill too. He can get a good shake like we just saw over there with the platform over there. Lots of cross-ups as well. Like, I'm, I'm seeing a lot of uh, just trickery coming out of Wario. Look at this. Three, two, one, go! Alrighty, here we go. Whoa, is that a B reverse on the bike? Interesting. Very interesting. Alright, up, up, up there, yep. Extra damage and a platform pressure too with the bite. Wow, just jumping right over that down tilt. Looks like Quick is trying to stay a bit more on the ground. Nothing but short hops and tilts. Yeah. Nicely done with that back air. Being able to put himself right back in the center of the stage and then some. Oh, I thought we were going to see a back air, uh, an up -y. I think he was trying to look for it, but Blue Team didn't quite give it to him. Nah. Bike pressure one more time. Let's see. Holding off with this air. I like it. Yeah, he was very cognizant of the bike. And I mean, he's gotten so many motors to the maze, I would imagine. Ah, the, uh, the anti air. So clean. He knows the range of that up air or that up smash like the back of his hand. Out. Oh, we tried to eat the bike, but it didn't quite work out there. Yeah, he tried. Yeah, he's trying to, he's stopping Glutiny for just charging at him like this. Okay, Quick is starting to mix it up one more time instead of throwing out there, just doing empty hops. That way he can punish Glutiny, trying to catch him. He almost gets the kill with that side beat. That would have been critical for him. Mm -hmm. Not quite. Oh, yeah. Man. It looks so slow, because there's a lot of startup frames that goes into picking up the bike and then throwing it on top of that, and he's getting it all the time. <laughs> Look at Wario. <laughs> oh my god, Spike. This, this, man, this, this man is something else, I gotta say. Some are not quite doing it either. Both way flat on the platform, trying to reposition himself or something. Not able to oh. get the step and get the jabs in. Very nice. This is the first time Zero Two Samus has successfully thrown the bike off stage. Props to you, Quick. All right. Very patient. <laughs> Even gets the, the drop animation from hanging on the ledge for too long. Ah, uh, gets the phantom hit that there. Oh man, that bear lasts forever for Wario. Man, okay. Wario living to 200 percent survivability. And I mean, that's Zero Two in a nutshell. Sometimes it's just hard to find the right kill. But there we go. Finally gonna get that side beam. Just catching the landing there. And you know, I, I, I gotta really make a point that uh, Glutiny is very adept at getting these shield pressuring situations. So he's able to do it so safe. Like he gets these up airs, he gets these back airs, he gets pretty much everything that he wants without really getting punished too much for it. Yeah, but that's, that's Wario in a nutshell too, is just that his aerials are so safe. And he's got very little landing lag on most of it, so he's gotta, miss, he's gotta space it really badly for that to happen. But he's not quite gonna let that happen. Kick. Gonna come out of the out of the range of the bike though, and get a little bit extra damage, and he blows up the bike as well. Mm, not quite getting the nair, but he was able to get a jab too. Uh, yeah, definitely missed space, but he still has that position. Oh, not getting this air. I'm surprised. Didn't even look like a touch Wario. I love that hiccup for him. He gets a down tilt and then catches him shielding, and he gets a grab instead, knowing that the down tilt and dash back not quite gonna connect properly. Then. That was really smart usage of the side B colliding into the bike. Yeah, extending the hits. Okay, almost poking that shield. Ah, man, yeah, Samus' uh, Zero Suit's lightness is really uh, being uh, exploited here. Nice down B, really reading Luffy there. 
Yeah, Clooney makes his attention snow when he approaches. Yes. All right, here we go. Last stock situation for this game here. Yeah, game five. Yeah. <laughs> There's that there. Oh, he's expecting a waft soon. Ah, uh, we're being trying to crack here. Yeah. Okay, Sarah. Oh. Get the grab when you want to. But throws the bike and that. Wow, that did actually a lot of damage. Right. Yeah, it did. Okay. Ooh, that was a tech chase situation. Okay. Ah, uh, I think we were about to see it back here. Quick there. Ah, the waft. Oh, dude, this is a 5-0 right now. That was really good for Slippy. I mean, in the first time he had to tech chase situation, he dashed back and then he knows that he teched away. And then the second time he had that opportunity, he just said, you know what, you're going to tech away. I'm going to run towards you and then you're going to get hit by up tilt into... Wow. Very nice stuff. Um, I think this is 2-0 well Gluttony favor right now. Um, for the set, if I recall correctly. Yeah. All the games are kind of munching together in my mind, so I'm getting spaced out. <laughs> But all right. No, uh, as a, yeah, this is 2-0 in this set, but uh, as a whole, it's like, it's been five games in a row for Kuzani. All right, this could be, this could be the final one. All righty, here we go. It's a real pain in the keyster to know that you uh, only had to win three, three your opponent had to win two, six. One, go! All right, this bike, this spike is such a factor. He doesn't there. even care. Oh, but that was very smart for him. Quick, he just ran underneath like the little arc that the semi produces. Oh yeah, Quick's not having it. I, I definitely agree. I see what he's doing here. He's not even really throwing out the stairs that much anymore. Or at least it, it, to contend with the bike. Okay. Nice back here, getting a little bit of shield pressure. Ah, those whiffs. Wow, those jabs barely connected, but he was able to get them. Okay, nice tipper forwards as well. Really liking what I'm seeing here. Nice incremental damage. Yeah, that's basically how the game plan has been. It's just that Gluten is able to burst even more damage. That's what the deciding factor has been on both of these games. He's got the pressure in, he's caught on shield drop. Hey, <laughs> trying to play uh, Gluten in his own game here. Good wave, uh, wave land. Down tilt. Okay, Delta on the grab. That's a first. I haven't seen that. I see. This kid comes in. Oh, he gets on this base though. SD, quick SD. I think that was just because too much pressure for Lutney on the edge guard there. Okay, there's that Nair. Combo. And 23. He did get a full combo. I mean, no, that was a full combo. Side B gonna keep him off just a little bit. Stop with the bike pressure here. Really making his attention with the bike uh, known. Okay. Nice down B. I really like that because if he uh, if he hit the bike, it, it just looked like it was going to hit uh, no matter what. That was really well. Ah, uh, okay. That right. was another read. Quick tried to mix it up there because he was always rolling back in those tech chase situations. He tried to do a neutral get him, but that was a scenario where he was just going to get that whap anyway. So now he's got himself a two stock beat here. He is riding this wave of momentum for sure. Uh, it's going to be very difficult for a to come back from this. So. I feel like Clinton has kind of got this in the bag as long as he's playing the same game that he has been the entire time. Keeping it safe, just getting those reverse damage when he needs it, and just knowing when things aren't going to quite connect properly, and just being able to still elicit pressure instead. And still get conversions off of that. Alright, Quick has a lot to think about here. Particularly that bike. Ah, oh, man. He really wants to rush into Gluttony right now, but it's just, it's so hard to do when that bike just comes out so quickly. It covers Landing. so many options. Snare, not gonna get anything out of that though, but 84%. That bike combo is huge, 60% actually. 
now he's got a down tilt, another grab comes in, the down throw, no tech chase, but still gets that prepare out of shield. Now he's himself in the bad position, 119%. Looney's done that before, throw the bike down, throw it back up. Oh yeah, okay, there we go, that forward tilt, this might mean something here. Ah! Nope. The 6 oh. That. Right. Mario wins! Congrats to Glutney. Yeah, I'm sure he's very jet lagged, but still uh, <laughs> able to keep that close and keep it around, and yeah. That's